Hello, Test Fam, and welcome to another Test Fam Family Adventure. Today, we're here in San Pedro, California, guys, and we're at the world famous San Pedro Fish Market. Unfortunately, we're happy, but we're very sad because in just a few weeks from now, this place will be permanently closing. And who knows where it's going to end up at. They said it's going to end up about 150 yards down the street, maybe at a different location. But we'll see, guys. Anyway, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button, guys. And let's get started, guys. Let's go eat some shrimp. Let's go eat some seafood. Let's go! All right, guys, so it looks like the line is extremely long, guys, and for good weight, it is the weekend. It is late in the afternoon. A lot of families here today. And of course, they're going to be closing their doors very soon, guys, in just maybe a few weeks from now, from the day that we're recording this, uh, on March 3rd, if I'm not mistaken, because their lease is up after 60 years in business. So, actually, we're going to show you guys a better idea and an alternative. So follow us, guys. Well, at least somebody made out with something, at least. kind of a bummer I'm really gonna miss this place we, we really had some great adventures here some great meals right babe some great seafood we did yeah fun adventures fun times lots of drinks lots of seafood a lot of snow cones too <laughs> but now guys it looks like they're fighting and they shut their doors I guess their lease is up uh, it's kind of a shame like I said 60 years in business that's that's almost as long as Disney I they opened up I think a year after Disneyland did Something like that. So, anyways, we're gonna head down to another uh, San Pedro Fish Market that's just on the road in Long Beach. They serve the exact same food, guys. I'm excited. I'm hungry. Let's do it. Jazz fam, just about 10 minutes away from the arena, and the whole family came with me. We ended up here. <laughs> it's the uh, San Pedro Fisherman's Market, except they what brought you know San Pedro. <laughs> San Pedro. San Pedro. <laughs> Anyways, it's here, it's in Long Beach, and it's just uh, 10 miles away from the San Pedro port. Where unfortunately, like I said, it's gonna close in just a little bit, but we made reservations. Really nice area, and we'll see what happens. Babes, you hungry? I'm super hungry. Layla, you hungry? Yes. You ready to eat? Yes. All right, guys, let's go get it. Come on, let's go get some seafood, finally. <sighs> what a journey. Let's go. So a couple advantages to, to coming and eating here, guys. For one, this place is a little bit more upscale than uh, the one over there in San Pedro. Yes, of course. It's all about the, the tradition and the legacy and all that good stuff. I, I get it, I get it. But like I said, unfortunately, it's going away. But this place has an excellent view of the marina. Look at this. Beautiful boats as far as the eye can see. So definitely a great spot. The building is beautiful. It seems like an upscale restaurant almost, you know, from the inside, but it looks like it has a great ambiance, a good buzz and a good vibe. I think we're going to have fun here spending our cash, for sure. Alright guys, we finally got to sit down, we're sitting down, we have so much to choose from like they have an abundance of seafood they have exactly the exact same food that you would get at San Pedro at the fish market they have the world famous trays full of seafood but here you can add on all kinds of other deep fried stuff they also have a fish market here as well too that you can actually get fresh seafood and add it onto your order fantastic I already got some drinks Miranda's got some some margaritas 
I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna have myself a big boy Michelada today. What, baby? Well, baby has some more drinks. Oh yeah, by the way, we, we bought grandma today. Say hi, grandma. Hi. <laughs> Everybody's gonna enjoy some seafood today. It's on daddy. Got the oysters, guys. I'm gonna make Dave try them. He's only had them, I think, one time. And he was super grossed out, but he's gonna try them again today. All right, so we got some fish and chips. Come on. We got some fried calamari. Then the baby's got some chicken fingers. <laughs> Not bad, right, babe? Good start? What, what the hell are these called? Oysters? Yeah. I've never had oysters before. Raw oysters. Raw oysters. Kind of funny to me. But I guess I'll do this for the channel. So here we go. Brenda already set it up. She put some lime and some chili. <laughs> Eat it. Follow it. I don't put the chili that long. I guess a lot of people swallow them. Yeah. I don't know, I'm not um, skilled as Miranda. But, <laughs> kind of fishy. Mm. Girl, look at that freaking mountain of seafood right there. What did you order? Uh, a little bit of everything from the sea. Repeat, we're gonna have a more fish to sell this. And of course, Daddy had to get his michelada, his regular beer, his regular drink. We got a lot of seafood to wash down. Look at that. So what do we got, baby? We got tilapia. What else we got? Whole lobster. Some type of fish. We got fish. Corn. Corn. Oysters. Mint. What is it? Uh, mussels and shrimp. Wow. And potato and veg. That is some spread. Look at that lobster, guys. Wow. That butter had no chance to survive, did it? We were hungry. We came to eat today. What kind of spice did you get? We'll try. We just got the original flavor, but I think there's two other ones you can order too. Um. Diablo and Cajun? Diablo and Cajun, yeah. You can make like the spice level basically. Yeah. So let us know what kind of signature is the way to go. We got the, what is it called? So I'll help you out, baby. We got the Alumino tray, and it comes with the fried fish, and tilapia, a whole lobster, bread, shrimp, mussels, corn, the veggies, butter sauce. What else did it come with? Oh, this is packed, it's so good. It's cooked on a plancha on the secret signature sauce. It is so good. It serves uh, anywhere from four to six people. But right now it's just more of us and we're <laughs> we're sending it up. We're like three of us to more. like our own meal. <laughs> <laughs> that is so good guys. I, I, I definitely recommend you, you try this. If you guys like going to San Pedro it's the exact same tray, except this one comes on a bundle. Now we don't have to order everything separate from different vendors or whatever. This one is just all in the same happy pot. Awesome food. And, and they bring it to you. You don't have to wait in a long line. Yeah, you, know, yeah, you can just sit down, relax, have your, have your michelada, have your beers. You can just chill. Show us that beer. Show us that michelada. Wait, look at this. Look at this bad boy. Look at this 32 ounce michelada right here. Well, jealous, but yeah, that's how you do it. See a big chug? Take a big chug. All right, guys. We've been putting in some work today. And you guys know what it is when you guys go to San Pedro. So why are we going to show you guys all the little nitty gritty stuff? But we're going to show you guys exactly how we left this tray of food. And let me tell you, it is not pretty. Look at this. Yeah, that poor fish had no idea what was coming to it. Lobster didn't know what the hell hit it. Brandon's over there, but Chan left the corner. Lobster. So bad. Look at hey, Grandma's over here thinking about her sins. <laughs> been a heck of a meal. I wouldn't consider this place 10 times better than San Pedro. Oh wait, hold on one second, we got one more. Baby, how's the food? Good. Good? 
You like it? What did you get? What did you get? Eating strawberries. I don't want to eat chicken. You got strawberries? Yeah. And you got some chicken tenders and some french fries. <laughs> but you didn't, you didn't really eat them. Oh, and you got a lemonade. That's right, look, guys, still got a second bunch of water right here. Anyways, guys, I definitely recommend this place 10 times more than San Pedro. One, the environment's a lot nicer, a lot cleaner. Hey, they have a full bar here. I feel like I don't have to bring my shank here, you know what I'm saying? Because I might get, you know, be wearing the wrong colors or, or something, you never know. And it's a beautiful setting on the outside. It's a beautiful marina, beautiful boats, sunset. We came here during sunset, it was gorgeous. And the service is great. The food is outstanding. It's exactly like it is in San Pedro, but I think it's a little bit cheaper here, to be honest with you. And I think they give you more. Yeah. Way more than the way you asked for. Uh, that you would well, usually get over there. In San Pedro, you would have to go to two or three different spots to get what they serve you here all in one in one tray. So I'm very excited, uh, very satisfied. People are passing out left and right over here from eating all that seafood. They're going to comas. But no, guys, this is a great spot to come to. Highly recommend it. I'm so sorry to see you, San Pedro, the whole actual pier and all that clothes. But I'm so glad that this place opened. And there's several locations, guys. We'll put the website down below so you guys can see what locations are closer to you guys to come and try. But definitely, I give this place a 5 out of 5. Fatboy Stains. And Miranda out here, I don't know. Miranda's still putting in work right here. I'm gonna show you some uh, some stock footage of her just turning it up. I dare you to kiss the fish. I dare you to kiss the fish. I dare you to kiss it. Kiss the kiss the fish. Kiss the fish. Girls, yucky. It's a fish. It's your turn. My turn. Okay, I'll kiss the fish. Okay. That poor fish. Aww. How sad. Poor fish, we ate it all. <laughs> no, this. Poor fish. Well, it was a fish. Yeah. It's all bones now, huh? The bones. No. All right, look, we got more oysters right here. Can you do it? Wait, so cool. Huh? I'm so cool. Yes, baby. Oh, it's an eye! Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Grandma, how you doing? I can't talk right now. You can't what? I'm not going to talk right now. I can't talk you right now? No. She says she can't talk you right now. No, whistle. Oh, she can't talk right now, not Kentucky. My bad, guys. I thought she wanted some fried chicken. I'm so full, guys. Like, we're done. All done. Look at that. My goodness, Miranda, what did we just do? Ate a whole lot, that's for sure. I think uh, under the water ain't gonna be a lot of fun. I'm sorry, Sebastian, I'm sorry for the cast of the Little Mermaid. We just ate half the cast of the Little Mermaid right now. I swear we ate Sebastian, we ate Flounder, we ate part of a mermaid. I have no idea, guys. Thank you so much to the San Pedro Fish Market today. Uh, it was amazing food today. Like I said, I'm so sorry that they're closing down shop, but hey, at least they have these locations open. The waiter said that they weren't closing, just remodeling. They said remodeling, but everybody's saying that they're closing. It's all over the news. So, I don't know. Maybe he's misinformed, we're misinformed. I don't care. The only thing we're not is not misfed. We are freaking full. Ladies and gentlemen, please hit that like. Please hit that subscribe. Brenda's getting the baby and grandma. They're going to go pass out in the car. I'm going to go think about what I just did, guys, because I just ate a lot of seafood. And I need to chill out from the Daz family, guys. We'll see you in the next one from the San Pedro Fish Market up in Long Beach, California, guys. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. I'm not gonna talk to him right now. I can't talk to you right now. No.